I welcome you all. And on behalf of Naomi and Ryan, and for myself, to say how thrilled they are that you are sharing this special day with them. I want to thank God for this special day in their lives. He can do amazing things, and he did so in bringing Ryan into Naomi's life. Naomi has grown into a caring and beautiful woman. I can't imagine not having a best friend like her, supporting me, loving me, and running along my side through all of life's up and downs. Mom, thank you for being my friend, teaching me to live through my values, and teaching me what it looks like to be a good wife. You two have always been my biggest cheerleaders and taught me to dream big. Dad, thank you for teaching me what to look for in a man. By taking me on daddy-daughter dates so that I knew how a man should treat me and to always know my worth and not settle for less than what I wanted. The first role you had in this world was as my baby boy. Since then, you've done so much to make me proud. I choose now to bless your marriage. Thank you for being such a stable part of my life, a great friend and an even better brother. And Naomi, always remember that Ryan loves you and could not do it without you. Seriously, I've seen him without you. Not pretty. Congratulations to the both of you and may your friendship continue to grow throughout the years to come. I love you, Ryan. Love you, Naomi. And uh, welcome to the family. Ryan, we want to thank you into our family. I think we've told our family how much you've blessed Naomi's life, but you've blessed our life too. And we welcome you as our new son. Ryan, we have had you in our family now for a year. And it's been a wonderful opportunity for our family just to grow and expand and to, to know you better, um, to watch my daughter blossom. And uh, you know what, you're just, you're good for her. Naomi Sinclair, you know me better than anybody else in the entire world, and somehow, I know with all my heart that you love me more than I ever thought was possible. You're my best friend, you're my one true love. Very often I see the littlest things that you do and know that I am the luckiest man to be alive. I vow to make my life forever yours and build my dreams around you. I vow to love you as your husband forever and ever, and to know that as we write our story together, it'll be the best story ever told. Today, in the presence of God, family, and friends, I, Naomi Sinclair, take you, Ryan Swan, to be my husband, my best friend, and my partner in life. I promise to respect you and to be honest with you. I promise to share in your dreams and encourage you. Since I can't promise perfection, I promise growth and commitment. I promise to laugh and to cry with you, loving you faithfully through good times and bad, regardless of the challenges we will face together. So today, Ryan, I give you my heart, my hand, my whole life too, from this day forward, as long as we both shall live. May you always have plenty and never lack. May you both always have each other's back. May you always be healthy and rarely ill. May you and each other feel loved and fulfilled. May your home be blessed with children's laughter. May giggles and hugs reign forever after. May both your hearts and your home be warm. May peace and joy be your norm. May your May lives be long and, and full, full of grace. grace. May you always seek the good Lord's face. Trees are made for climbing, days are made for sun, puddles are for jumping, fields are made to run, stars.
Naomi cannot live without him. And Ryan, I am so glad you're here for her. Like, you have filled everything for Naomi. She deserves you. You deserve her. Thank you so much for being the man she's looking for. May the good Lord bless and keep you. Fill you with his peace. His face will shine upon you even as you sleep. So I welcome Ryan as a brother. It's very important to me that Naomi is taken care of. And so I appreciate you doing that for her. And with that, I'd like to wish the bride and groom a happily ever after. Through all of those memories, I can't imagine we would continue to have even better ones. But I know the best years of our friendship are yet to come. And now as she moves into a new chapter of her life, striving every day to become a woman of strength to support Ryan in all areas of their life together. And it brings me so much joy to know that Ryan will do the exact same in return to her. Now, there was a time Naomi didn't want anything to do with any guy, ever. <laughs> then along came Ryan. And she didn't want anything to do with him either. <laughs> but a little perseverance, and a bit of luck, and quite a lot of begging, was just what was needed to get Naomi on that first date. Here we stay. and Mrs. Swan.
laugh at any choices that Naomi makes, just remember that she chose you. It's your is not about finding a person you can live with it's about finding a person you can't live without Ryan and Naomi you have found those people in each other here's to a lifetime of happiness and love for Ryan and Naomi God bless